What's going on everybody? Spidey Gaming here with another WWE 2K Battlegrounds video. In today's video I'm going to show you the fastest way possible to earn Battle Bucks in 2K Battlegrounds. And in case you didn't know, Battle Bucks are basically the in-game currency for 2K Battlegrounds which you can use to purchase unlockables in the store and you can also unlock the WWE Superstars that are currently locked right now each one of these you have to unlock individually using battle bucks now i'm going to show you the fastest way to do this and for this video i'm actually going to use triple h and you're going to see why in just a few seconds here but triple h does have the fastest taunt i believe of any of the superstars so we're going to go into exhibition mode one on one now make sure you have a second controller that you can use and this is going to help out a lot. So we're just going to play against player two. We're not going to play against the computer and you can do this so much faster. So we're going to go ahead and select Triple H and just pick one of the weakest superstars on the roster. I just picked Akira Tozawa. No offense Akira, that's just what the stats are. All right, so we go into the match, and as you can see, I'm spamming the taunt button, which is down on the D-pad, in case you didn't know. We're going to fill our heat meter, and there we get our signature move, and then we're just going to keep repeating that over and over again. And you can see how quickly the taunt is for Triple H. It's like one of the fastest in the game, and we're just going to repeat this process. Pick him up, slam him with the spine buster. Let's get it again. Basically what we're going to do is do this until we hit our finisher, the pedigree. You can see Akira's health now is just about to go into the red. Hit it one more time with the spine buster. Again, spam it. Of course, you could do this with any superstar you want, but Triple H has the fastest taunt, which you could just do this so much, so much more quickly doing it this way but if you have a lot of time to kill you can you can play as anyone as you want but the important thing is just playing as player two because then you don't have to worry about the computer and all the randomness and all that so we're going to go ahead and hit the finisher and there's the pedigree boom and then we finish the match go for the cover one two and three and then you're going to see here how many battle bucks we got after that just keep spamming the X button until we get to the screen where it shows the battle bucks there you go 187 battle bucks earned in that match we also leveled up so that's gonna be some extra battle bucks right there but basically what you're gonna do is just repeat that process over and over again so once you skip all these screens it's going to ask you if you want to play again so you are going to select play again and basically you just keep repeating over and over again now it's not a lot of battle bucks you earn in the match but if you're doing this it say it takes you maybe a minute to do it like that is a lot of battle bucks that you could be earning depending on how much time you got now just some bonus tips here if you want to earn some extra bonus bucks make sure you check out your daily challenges see what you have to do to earn those also you could jump into the king of the battlegrounds mode which i was playing just a little bit earlier and look i even got bonus bucks just for participating uh, it's basically just like king of the hill style just fighting online players just surviving as long as possible I think you can get like up to like 3,000 battle bucks or something doing this but that can take a long time depending on how long you stay in the match um, on top of that you can go into the battleground challenge which is for your created superstar so you can go ahead and do that and you can follow the missions and matches and all that stuff that they have for your created superstar and another quick tip is once you've done as many as you want to do or completed the whole thing, you could actually delete your superstar, create a new one, and jump right back into it and repeat that process again if you have a lot of time to kill doing that. 
but in terms of just straight up farming battle bucks as quickly as possible this is the best way jump into one on one matchup with player two just spam that taunt get those signatures and finishers and there you have it you should be good to go so hopefully you guys learned something new in this video if you have make sure you drop a like on the video if you're new watching for the very first time want to find your way back for some more 2k battlegrounds content make sure you super kick that subscribe and turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss a moment of the action coming to you in 2k battlegrounds until next time folks i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope to see you at ringside in the next one don't you dare miss it